Johnstown City Council held its first meeting since deciding to repeal sewer line pressure testing over a month ago, and tonight a new plan was presented. Jacqueline Kovac has more on that. It's new at 11. City leaders repealed the ordinance requiring pressure testing for city residents, but they presented a new ordinance that would give people more time and more options. During Wednesday city council meeting, council members voted to repeal the ordinance requiring pressure testing, but introduced a new ordinance in its place. Bill 16 basically uh, reintroduces pressure testing along with camera and televising but extends the period of time out into the future in which it has to actually be put into compliance on a residential lateral basis. The new one introduces a choice for homeowners, allowing them to opt for camera testing. Camera scoping, you may find a little defect at the end of your line, right where you connect to the city line, which would be a minor fix as compared to pressure testing, which pretty much you're guaranteed to fail. The city hopes this new ordinance will allow the neighborhood flow levels to be more true. Uh, once we get through a monitoring period, uh, see how the flows are. Hopefully everything is fine. There's no need for additional re remediation. Uh, but should the flow still be above the DEP mandated levels, uh, we will at that point in time have to then go back and require pressure testing as well as and or uh, camera testing televising. City leaders say the flows will be monitored in every area of the city and one area's flow will not be impacted by another. Those who fought the previous ordinance see this as a step in the right direction. I've been saying all along, just do the street work first, get rid of the downspouts because you can't get that accurate overflow rate until everything's out of the system and it seems like that's going to happen. This was just the first read of the new ordinance. The final read will take place in next month's meeting where council can accept or reject it. Jacqueline Kovac, 6 News. Also